Motown era is known for its profound talent such as Marvin Gaye, Aretha Franklin, The Four Tops, and a host of others. However, little is known about the musicians that helped support these artists along the way. In this story, we will talk about Sidney Cheney, a musician who made countless contributions to Motown via his musicianship and the life that he lived. This is his story. Sidney Cheney was born and raised in the city of Detroit and had music flowing through his genes. A product of Detroit public schools and influenced by the sounds of the mid-1950s to early 1960s, Cheney couldn't help but to leave his own sound in the city. A natural drummer, Cheney started playing drums in elementary school and honed his craft in high school by creating his own band. Fondly referred to as Sid, his band and his style of play had developed a name for itself throughout Detroit. Performing in venues such as Doug's Body Shop and playing for artists like Othea Barnes and Rhonda Clark. In fact, Chani produced the song Sugar on Rhonda Clark's 1989 album Between Friends for Taboo Records. Sadly, his contributions to Motown were not properly documented or recorded. Therefore, it is difficult to say what his true impact was for Motown's sound. Motown often didn't acknowledge their session players or keep proper records on them. Although Sidney Cheney had made a small imprint on music, he also struggled with the troubled past that often spilled over into his work. Unfortunately, his past caught up to him and he was murdered on the west side of Detroit. Be mine and the light. Dear. 